Okay, so this is going to be my third video on this truck. I, If you can't see, it's kind of uh, dirty, dusty. I, I've been messing with it a little bit. Let me turn it on right here. Got it on. It's, uh, it does have a little battery. You guys, if you can't tell. Steering is a little weak. So, okay. Let's get it over here. Yeah, it's pretty low on the battery. I've been running it for about 15 minutes. And, uh, you get about 20, 30 minutes of, uh, charge time. But, uh, I'll show you the lights on it. Now they might they, they do kind of look a little bright in the uh, in this video, but uh, in real life they aren't really bright. Bright, they're kind of like a dim, like a flashlight's going out. Um, one other thing that if you didn't, if I didn't mention this already, um, this does have a differential in the back, so that helps a lot. But uh, show you the reverse lights. See, they're not they're not too great it's a little it's, it's loud um i did try replacing uh the or fixing my um uh, turning part uh little uh part that's broken down here can you say it um so but you can tell that the the steering is a little a little weak on that side so um it, it as you can tell it's kind of it's kind of falling down you see the little straightness throughout there this one is falling down a little more so i'm wondering if it's uh still broken see it needs to be up a little bit if i get a whole damn thing straight see it needs to go up like that um I hot glued it, but that's probably just a little gap where the hot glue is, so it's hanging down a little lower. That's kind of dirty. Um, like I said, I kind of want to replace the top rail lights. They are a little weak. Hit this back up again. Let's see, those ones are pretty pretty bright on the screen, but they're not not huge hugely bright. Horribly. Um, it does have some good speed. Um, as you can tell, the, the battery is pretty weak right now. It's, it's probably on its last little bit. Um, I'm going to turn it off. You have a little cheap controller with an extendable battery. I'm going to take the, the top of it off for you real quick. As you can tell, those little uh, white things come off. Little clips come off. I'm going to do this little antenna that I have kind of tied on here, so I'll hold the box on just a little bit. Um, this is always the hardest yet. But anyways, yep, comes off really easily. And, uh, you can see that's, that's the light connection, that's, that's the whole setup. Um, get my slipper on, but, um, yep. You can uh, see it's got the shocks in them. See, the antenna is just kind of like laying here as, as is. But uh, you guys have any suggestions on where to buy some of these parts? Like I want to get a new steering servo and maybe mount that in there. Um, I'd really like to because this one's weak. Um, might might have to get a, a different... Um, motor for it. Uh, the battery's a pretty good big size battery. Um, like I said, if you guys see any that, uh, or you know any kind of motors I could upgrade this with, or another vehicle, one of those kit vehicles, um, I would greatly appreciate it. I do not want to spend $700 on a little kit. That I, I just want this kind of be weekend fun. So, or if, if I do find a kit that's kind of expensive and I want to kind of use a, a box like this big truck box. Not the best, but you know, I could always upgrade some of these lights for it. Um, I do know what I'm doing with circuits, so I could probably make a little uh, 
circuit for the lights to run off of an on and off switch for them, maybe even in the back. But uh, like I said, if you guys see anything, greatly appreciate any input on this. And I'll put that back to back on.